Hi, I'm meteorologist Dave Warren. Showers going to move you through the area. This is primarily in Broward County, although a few have been developing as far south as uh, downtown Miami or uh, Miami Dade. Uh, but there is the county line. It continues to push right through uh, central Broward County near 595. More developing off the coast. All of this working its way west pretty quickly here is pretty much between Griffin and Sheridan, uh, south of 595 between the Turnpike and 75. Heavier rain moving to the west uh, there. There's Cooper City right in it uh, there. A few more showers developing off the coast. A little bit of moisture moving with the breeze. However, all of this trying to work through the area should be breaking up just a bit later this afternoon and then clearing up here overnight tonight. You go farther south and you just run into a spotty shower or two over Biscayne Bay, one or two uh, over the Upper Keys, and uh, should continue to work its way to the west. That's picked up now, and this takes us each hour. See a little activity trying to develop here between about 2, 3 o'clock, but by 4 to 5 o'clock with that breeze, everything tries to push through the area, and we don't see as much development developing off the coast, so maybe winding down later this afternoon or this evening. Rain cooled 77, otherwise sunshine through those clouds, heating things up warm and humid up to 85 right now. Miami should top out about 86 degrees. There's the beach weather. If you're not getting a shower, not a bad day, just a bit of a breeze there coming in from the east about 5 to 10 miles an hour here uh, across the area. Now for the rest of the day and tonight, we start to clear things up after about 4 o'clock. Temperatures will drop down into the mid to low 80s. 80 and clear at 6 by 9 to 12. Midnight tonight, temperatures dropping into the upper 70s. High pressures kept us dry, but now we're getting the warm air in the showers. A front slowing down as it approaches from our north finally pushes through after the weekend, and that's when the breeze picks up. Gets pretty gusty there by the middle of next week and gets a little cooler. Not a big drop in temperatures, but we're near record highs over the weekend. Then we get a little cooler on Monday. Still in hurricane season, but nothing expected here over the next seven days. We'll keep an eye on the outlook. They'll continue to issue it every day here, uh, but for now things are quiet. Seven days, you have uh, warm temperatures Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. The front nearing the area turns the wind northeast and it gets gusty. That'll drop the temperatures and give us a few more showers moving with the breeze next week.